Hi guys, welcome to Florida Kitchen. I just boiled spaghetti and I'm gonna do a spaghetti with um, in salsa alfredo. And the one that we're gonna be using is the classic alfredo pasta sauce. You could use any type of alfredo. So I just boiled it for 10 minutes al dente and just put salt while it's boiling. So I'm gonna put it in the pot and I'm gonna do it with uh, tuna. So that's very easy. I'm just gonna be doing that with chunk light and water tuna so let me put that in the pot let me just heat that up a little bit and i'm gonna put the uh, spaghetti okay that's a little hot right now all right so i just put that in my pot i'm just gonna mix that up all right and i'm not putting any oil on it and i'm just gonna put one can of tuna so this is the most simple easiest recipe okay so I'm gonna remove the water that's there from the tuna oops just make sure to remove that okay whether it's oil or water okay my beautiful friends I'm adding actually two cans of tuna okay so instead of adding a shrimp I'm adding tuna so this is a good substitution and it's actually quite delicious okay so um, I'm going to be adding that alfredo sauce. Let me turn the heat up now. And it's super simple. You just boil the spaghetti. And okay, and now I'm going to be adding that alfredo sauce. Okay. Probably this recipe is not um, out there. <laughs> This was an invention of ours, but it's a super easiest invention and quite economical too. It's actually quite healthy because of the tuna, not because of the alfredo sauce. Okay. I'm going to be mixing that up. And don't let it stay on the uh, kitchen or don't let it stay cooking for so long probably a maximum of five minutes because remember that your your spaghetti is already cooked you just want to mix those flavors okay now I'm gonna be adding just a tad water just a tad bit of water on this alfredo sauce jar just a tad and then I'm gonna be mixing this cover this with the top and just shake this okay and then I'm going to be adding the, the juice of this jar of alfredo sauce inside the pot awesome I have the uh, stove at medium heat and I'm almost finished and if you notice there's nothing to it just boil the pasta add two cans of tuna before I added just one but if you want it to be a little more meatier just add two cans and the make sure to get a big jar of alfredo sauce so that you can make it creamier cream, creamier and just add a little bit of water to that jar and that's it and we're done here so I'll be serving that in a plate in a bit Okay, my beautiful friends, so this is the end results. Also, I missed you guys. I haven't been filming. I know it's been some time now, but uh, I'll try my best to be filming some more uh, videos. Now, I forgot to add that uh, you should put a little bit of salt and black pepper. However, the black pepper is optional. And we added some um, cheese on top, some Parmesan grated cheese on top. Um, and you could add any other type of cheese you'd like so it smells very creamy and delicious and hopefully you guys make this a uh, very simple recipe an economical one all right guys see you soon and uh, thank you for visiting my channel at Florida kitchen bye bye